the USGS Hawaiian Volcano Observatory say that there has been no explosive event since yesterday morning, but they do anticipate another one within the next few hours. The statement was made during an 11 a.m. press briefing today. HVO volcanologist Wendy Stovall said that there's a pattern that develops as activity ramps up to an explosion. She said that today in the summit region there has been small rock falls, lots of earthquakes, and small ash plumes. Down at the lava ocean entry point, Kapoho Bay is completely filled in. The lava has extended beyond the shoreline and is now at least 0.8 miles out from its original location. Scientists describe the flow that entered Kapoho Bay as an a'a flow, a term for lava flows that have a rough, rubbly surface composed of broken lava blocks. Many have likened the a'a flows to the tread of a bulldozer, saying that it breaks down and consumes anything in its path. Soval said the flow front that made its way to Kapoho Bay probably had an undulating height. Geologists had measured the lava height at the ocean entry point at around 3 to 4 meters, or 9 to 13 feet tall. More video and photos along with a live stream of the Kilauea Summit is posted on our website. For Maui Now, I'm Wendy Osher.